Hi, 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 this, this is, is Doc Mountain, Mountain and I welcome you to my YouTube channel. If it's your first time visiting this channel, go ahead and uh, hit the subscribe button. Okay, so now without any further ado, let's get into this. We are going to look at transformers. So by the end of this day, you should be able to define what a transformer is. And then you should be able to describe mutual induction and uh, you should as well be able to describe how a transformer operates then you should be able to state the components of a transformer so now we're not looking at a complex transformer but we're just looking at a simple transformer from uh, the perspective of a book uh, so now here we go a transformer first things first a transformer is actually a device that actually uses that uses mutual induction to vary voltage from one value to the other. So that's what a transformer is. It's simply a device that uses mutual induction to vary voltage from one value to the other. Okay, so now you may have a question that what is mutual induction? So mutual induction is simply the effect caused when changing current in a coil, when changing current in a coil induces an electromotive force in the neighboring coil or in the coil which is actually closer to this coil. Right, so now, let me explain this in depth. This coil which is called the primary coil is actually connected to the AC source, the alternating voltage source and it's actually that alternating voltage source that actually sages the current through this primary core. So now that changing because an alternating current keeps on changing its direction as well as its magnitude. They actually forms a magnetic field around this core. Now this magnetic field is actually made up of what we call the magnetic field lines and that's the magnetic flux. As it keeps on changing or varying, what happens is those magnetic field lines extend up to this far end covering the second coil. And when that happens and it keeps on changing, as the current keeps on changing here, even the magnetic flux keep on changing. Now, when the magnetic flux cuts the coil here, electromotive force is actually in, induced in the secondary coil and current flows. Now, the other part, this, this secondary coil is actually connected to the loads. This is the part where ele electrical appliances may be con connected. So here we've said there is a an alternating current which actually flows through the primary core. This side, it's only DC current which is actually induced. DC means direct current. So this side we have direct current, we have alternating current. I've, I've, I've already gotten into the components of a transformer. So now let's just finish up. The, the transformer is actually made up of the primary core, it has the iron, the iron core. So the core of the transformer is made up of the iron, iron metal. Okay. And then the secondary core is connected to the, to the lot, the electrical appliances and then the primary core is connected to the alternating. I'd actually gotten into how 
the transformer operates. So the transformer operates like this. The primary coil is connected to the alternating current source. And when current flows through the primary coil, of course it keeps on changing its directions and uh, magnitude. When that happens, there's a magnetic field which is actually formed around this and it extends up to this far end covering the secondary core. Now because there is alternating current, the magnetic flux keeps on changing. It extends back, it extends forth. Now the magnetic field lines keep on cutting the secondary coil and that induces electromotive force which actually brings about the flow of direct current which is actually used to power up the appliances which are connected at the farm. So well, that's about transformers, their components, how you can define them and how they operate. If you've liked the video, I urge you to go ahead and like it, drop a comment in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe because there will be a series of videos that will actually be coming on Transformers. If you don't want to miss, hit on the subscribe button. Thank you so much. Stay blessed.